Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Oh, you can come in. It's open. Well, well, well. Ain't you a sight for sore eyes. Hey there, buttercup. Come on, sit down. So your friend, uh, your friend Kirishima, he told me about you. Even though I knew about you already. You're a nice person, and I appreciate you for taking my advice all those, all the way back when. You did a pretty dang good job of becoming a hero yourself. <laughs> but of course. I mean, with all due respect, I feel like you'd be a great hero. Well, you are a great hero, but I feel like you could be better. Oh, yes, way better. I got an agency just for you. It's my agency. Mm-hmm. But there is a few things that I have to talk to you first about it. Although there are quite a lot of benefits when it comes to my agency and whatnot, but... You got to learn how to respect others here and also make sure that all your clientele and whatnot are safe. Because over here in my agency, we make sure that our friends are completely fine before we go into any type of danger. Do you understand me? Of course, there's I always have a bowl of candy open for everybody. So. My first question for you is, why did you want to become a hero in the first place? Well, alright, alright. Interesting, interesting. Okay. All right, that's a good. That's a good. That's good enough. Mm hmm. You have great potential behind you. Although I think I've told you that before. Mm hmm. With your quirk and whatnot, it's amazing the things that you can do. And also, I've heard you've already gone on a few missions for as a pro hero. Is that right? Well, damn. You went on spy missions already. Did you handle it well? Not saying you're not capable enough to handle it yourself, but spy missions are quite hard to pull off. Well, I'm glad you did it, because we got good information out of it. Mm-hmm. Hawks and Endeavor told me all about it. You're quite a good spy. Mm -hmm. You can color me impressed. Now, my second question to you is, what's more important to you when it comes to heroism? Is it the fame and fortune, or is it for the people that you save and make sure they're okay? Good answer. You always got to make sure that civilians are A-OK -okay no matter what, even if you feel like you have become somewhat of a celebrity beyond the streets and whatnot. You don't get that fame to your head, nor the money. The money don't mean nothing unless you save people. 
that is what a true hero is all about. Make sure people are all right and make sure people are safe. Okay. Question three. In a hypothetical sentence, well, not sentence, let me rephrase that. In a hypothetical situation, between a few people stuck under some rubble and a villain right in front of you, but you do have backup, what do you do? Do you A, fight the villain head on and tell the others to get to the rescue of the other people, or... Do you tell the others to deal with the villain themselves and you go rescue the other people who are stuck under the rubble? Okay, okay. You're more of a people person. You'd rather save others who are in critical conditioning than fight a villain for yourself. You're more of a support type of person. Good to know that. We need more people like that on my side. On our uh, internship. Mm Mm-hmm. Question four. You like food? (laughs) This was more of a rhetorical question. Of course everybody loves food. Especially me. I mean, I eat a lot of it. I mean, how do you think I got all this fat on me? I gotta eat a lot more food than the regular person, otherwise my fat's just not gonna be there no more. And, I use a lot of body fat when I use my power, my quirk. So, I gotta eat a lot. And, it gets me to my next subject. You see, here in my agency, we make sure everybody's well fed. And so, all catering and whatnot is completely free. You don't need to pay out of pocket or anything like that. Everything here, for food wise, is free. Sleeping arrangements are kind of the same way. I mean, we're all stuck here in the UA building, so you're just going to be sleeping in your own uh, quarters and whatnot. My agency is just across the way anyway. Mm Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. It's like, um... Let's see. If we're talking about your quarters, which is way, way, way on the other side of the UA building. It's on the other side. So, it might take a few minutes for you to walk over here. But I don't think you don't mind the walk. Yeah, I didn't think so. And question five. Are you ready for being a hero? Well, I asked that question because, well, not a lot of people are sure about becoming a pro hero or whatnot, like you were back when. You were confused on how to use your powers properly and who and what to save. I understand that you were confused. I make sure to talk you through it. I make sure to tell you that true heroism doesn't come from just the power. It comes straight from the person itself. You gotta make sure that you're A-OK mentally and physically to become a pro hero. You gotta make sure that you have the right mindset to become a pro hero because if you don't have the right mindset well you might make a few mistakes and of course i can't judge you for those mistakes because we're all human we can't just we can't just go against our words of humanity and if we did well there'll be a lot more villains in this world than there is heroes so i ask you again are you ready to be a pro hero (laughs) <laughs> well, I'm glad to say it. Welcome to my agency. If you ever want an opening, you have it. Of course, 
Anything for my buttercup. <laughs> but you're gonna have to tell uh, Aizawa, uh, who else you getting trained under? Is it Hawks and Endeavor? Mm, yes. So you gotta tell those three that you're gonna sign up with my agency. You're gonna be seeing a lot more of me and a lot more of your friends who are also in this agency as well. Like Kirishima and Tamaki. They're great heroes. Just like yourself. <laughs> All right. Well, I got a few more meetings I got to get to, so I got to let you go. But, like I said, talk to your mentors first, and then you can sign to my agency. All right, buttercup. I'll see you later, then. <laughs>